Hello, my name is Anthony Hamilton Russell. I'm the owner and founder of Southern Right, and we are celebrating our 25th vintage this year with the release of the 19s of a single Pinotage, no reserves, no second labels, and a single Sauvignon Blanc, no reserves and no second labels. I founded Southern Right in 1994, really initially to make up for all the wines we had discontinued from Hamilton Russell Vineyards when I took over in 91 to focus on Pinot Noir and Chardonnay. We had some spare cellar space. I was really committed to working with Pinotage as a South African. I felt it almost a duty to work with our national grape, however popular or unpopular it was at the time. And we searched for a white wine partner to go with Pinotage. Now logically, for that South African positioning, it might have been a Chenin Blanc. For four years, we tried making Chenin Blanc in a number of different ways alongside Sauvignon Blanc, experimentally, and found that whenever we were left with a choice of a glass of the Sauvignon Blanc or a glass of the Chenin, we preferred the Sauvignon Blanc, which happens to be an early ripener, well suited to the Walker Bay area, the Walker Bay district, and we decided in the end not to let the marketing idea drive the offering, but more what we could do best. So right at the beginning, with our first release in 95, we settled on a single Sauvignon Blanc and a single Pinotage. Now the reputation we've gained over the years, and selling now in about 45 different countries, has been for understated, elegant, classically styled wines, well suited to fine gastronomy. Not that they don't do well in retail, but we find these have been in some very prestigious restaurants by the glass, both the Pinotage and the Sauvignon Blanc, which makes us really proud. From the far north of the Northern Hemisphere, right down to the South Pole, where we sent our wines down uh, with a scientific mission, had them photographed at the South Pole, and really that was symbolic. The Southern Right Wales, that the wines are named after, are very closely associated with Walker Bay, only around 1,500 meters behind me. Those Southern Right Wales commute down to just off Antarctica to feed during the winter months and spend uh, during the summer months here and spend quite a lot of the winter months uh, mating and carving in Walker Bay. We chose this symbol to closely associate the wines with a strong maritime influence of Walker Bay that all the vineyards are planted near. And because we used this symbol free of charge, we made the decision right from day one to make small contributions to conservation of Southern Right Wales, and we've done a lot of work over the years in that regard. Southern Right Wales have actually are doing incredibly well at the moment, and we have decided also to focus our conservation efforts on indigenous vegetation in the area. In fact, on our neck label, the Latin Naturam Esse Omne, I gather, means nature is everything, and it's very much part of our ethic, sustainable farming, sensitivity to the environment, and as much conservation work as we can afford. We're very proud to have our 25th Vintages.